Is it possible to capture and get across the main points of your research in 15 seconds? That is the challenge facing Tommaso Sono, a young economist who's been shortlisted by the ECB for a prize. As part of that, he has to create a 15 second video that will be put in front of senior economists and policymakers at the ECB, including Mario Draghi. Three, two, in our paper, we show theoretically and empirically that increased financial frictions can lead to anti-competitive effects, hindering the relocation process usually ensuing after a crisis. As a bonus, we also offer you a new structural measure of credit constraints at the firm level. So we've got across the crux uh, of what you're talking about in 15 seconds. Let's say your audience understands everything you just said. Could we change the order of things to try and capture them uh, at the beginning? And then uh, the second thing is, can we use the language that would make them care even more and would make more people care? The relocation process typically ensuing after a crisis can be slowered by anti-competitive effects coming from increased financial frictions. In our paper, we show this theoretically and empirically, and we also offer you a new structural measure of credit constraints at the firm level. Rather than sort of talk about the, uh, the features of what you're going to offer them, if you could perhaps sort of set it in, the, in terms of the benefits that they might get from it. Something along the lines of, after a crisis or a shock, uh, we would hope that the economy recovers in the most efficient way, uh, particularly firms, thereby uh, ensuring the minimal number of job losses and getting back to full employment as soon as possible. We show in our paper that this is restricted heavily due to credit constraints uh, for firms. So then we, we're into problem, your solution, uh, which is starting off that we show this, and then the next thing you'll say is, and we have a measure of how credit constrained firms are. After an economic crisis, we hope that firms react quickly in order to minimise job losses. We show that a big thing holding firms back is a lack of access to loans, and we provide a new measure of firms' credit constraints, thereby showing steps towards a possible solution. Fantastic, we've got it. Great. Okay, boom. There we go. We are done. Okay, fantastic.